Hey, this is John Young. What we're looking at today is a gooseneck light here. This is a little magnetic gooseneck light. This has got an LED in the front of it there. And I'll just turn that on. This particular one is just an on-off. There's no high, medium, low or anything to that effect, which is actually something I'm going to give it bonus points for that because I get tired after a while of the high, medium, low if I'm using it on a work light. It's really frustrating. This is, what's kind of cool about this one, is that it's a gooseneck, which is, you know, that's nothing too exciting. But most goosenecks are kind of made kind of cheaply. And they you go and you put them in a spot and they'll either start to sag, which this one doesn't do. Or you put it in a weird configuration and it doesn't stay, that it'll kind of straighten out just a little bit. It'll straighten out just a little bit. This one doesn't do this. This one stays where you put it, which is absolutely fabulous. And it's got a really strong magnet too. Let me just turn it here a little bit and I'm gonna give you an idea of what it can do. So there it is, it's blasting me out. I'm gonna turn it so it's on the back wall there. Now this is kind of neat that it has the ability to go from a spot, there it is, and you can see that it's a little cob LED with that little square there, and it can come out to a flood. Now we're talking, you know, two, maybe two and a half, 30 inches roughly, and it's giving us about a 30 inch circle. So if you're putting this like say up on the hood of your vehicle and aiming it down, you're gonna have a nice 16 inch roughly area. To, uh, to work. Just a little rubber button there. Now, one of the things i not exactly overly excited, if I had something like this and it was rechargeable, this would be like a, a gold run out and you've got to have one immediately today. Unfortunately, they're using AAA batteries. They supply you with a first set of AAA batteries, which is certainly nice. And AAA batteries are readily available. And for those who are concerned about, you know, getting lithium batteries and then having to dispose of them, this, I guess, would be the, the next best option. But I kind of like rechargeable stuff that I can plug it into my, my USB device, charge it up, and then it's good for a while. And, and then, of course, have a little, a little battery indicator would be the only two steps above that I would highly recommend. But other than that, I'm really impressed with this little light and its ability to aim it where I want it and it stays. There's no aim it where I want it and it drifts down, which many gooseneck lights will do. So I'm gonna put a link in the description below so you can check this one out. I think for most people, this is gonna be a great little option with the AAA batteries. It's going to have a shelf life and you're gonna be able to put it away, You know, buy decent batteries, put it in your, your and you're gonna have it ready for when you need it. And then, of course, if you want to use it outside during those cold times, get better quality. The Energizer lithium batteries, and I'll put a link for those also, those are going to help you uh, be able to use this and store it for years and to be able to use this during the sub-zero temps outside. Or if you leave it in your glove compartment, you can do that with those really high-end batteries. This is John Young. Thank you for watching. For more tips and how-to videos, go to WeekendHandyman.com.